want to know what your problem is? No. You are all about instant gratification, and that's not how forgiveness and redemption works. Sometimes when reality shifts, people need some time to assimilate, and sometimes you just have to let things find their place again, or not. Okay, well, not is not an option. Okay, then put yourself in Spinelli's place. If he cheated on you, would you be so quick to forgive and forget and move on? <laughs> that is a terrible analogy. Why? Because Spinelli would never cheat on me. He's not like that. You're a very circular person. I'm just worried that Spinelli's not going to do something soon to even the score, and then we're not going to be able to get back on this track. This is such wrong-headed, convoluted thinking. Maxie, this is how it goes. You feel guilty and remorseful, and Spinelli feels angry and hurt, and this Franco incident is going to be between you guys for a while, but you will work through it. You'll probably be closer than ever, because Spinelli is a forgiving person, and he loves you like wildfire. You just need to give it time. No, don't you understand that time is the enemy? Time is what allows uh, anger and hurt to fester under something harder, something unforgiving and set in stone, something that you can't come back from. No, I need this to blow over. And I need to fast track that. And in order for that to happen, Spinelli and I have to be on the same playing field. I need to make sure he gets into bed with someone as soon as possible. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, how about something that you haven't probably thought of? Let's say Spinelli does go along with the scheme. What happens if he actually likes the person that he cheats with? that you said something so mean to me. What? It's not unthinkable. You were attracted to Franco. That's why you slept with him. Why wouldn't Spinelli be attracted to the girl that he sleeps with? Because that's not what I want at all. That's the point I'm trying to make. Oh. It's not always about what you want. So why don't you try something different and let things just fall out naturally? And get old waiting, like you. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Well, I mean, I'm, I might have made a huge mistake by sleeping with Franco, but at least I found a moment out of my comfort zone and I ran with it. Yeah, I'm still not following. Well, you know, you're crazy about Dominic. Don't even try to deny it, Lulu. It's all over that goofy face of yours every single time you see him. Somehow Dominic managed to get through that cast iron built around your heart, and good for him. I, I would think that you would be happy. Instead, you can't even admit to yourself, let alone Dominic, that you have feelings for him. Oh my God. Let it go, Lulu. Take a chance. First of all, I, I don't even know how this became about me, but secondly, I think I missed something because you were warning me away from Dominic. Since when do you ever listen to me? If you like Dominic, go for him. And considering his line of work, I wouldn't waste a whole lot more time if I were you.